Uh oh. some spray film to fill in the gaps all the way around we're going to trim all this back once we get the trim back we'll start our fiberglass process what we got so far too bad it's coming along pretty good here we're going to trim this down a little bit more get my angle where i need it at and then we will start to lay a little bit of fiberglass all right we got the foam sanded down all the way around next step so this next part is either going to go real good or real bad. Shout out to my boy Caleb on the Belt YouTube channel. He's been walking through this process. I couldn't locate my spray adhesive, so we're going to lay the first layer with this, and then we'll lay some glass over top. I hope this works, because I really don't want to have to undo this. mixed up here I'm using a waxed cardboard box <clears throat> which makes it very easy to get this off or move your uh, bondo around so it's a little tip for you guys if you have any waxed cardboard boxes they definitely come in handy <music> bit of sanding so after I got the glass laid down a little bit of sanding it's a slow process but the shape is most definitely there it's a little more cleanup and then I'm gonna lay a little bit of body filler to fill in these small pinholes that are scattered throughout the fiberglass and we'll get her primed up and ready to throw some paint on all right, I laid body filler pretty much over the entire spoiler. Uh, this was part of the molding process at the bottom, but there were a lot of waves across this top section and a bunch of imperfections along the back of the fin. So I just decided to skim coat the whole thing. Once this sets up, I will go ahead and sand everything down and she should be ready for primer. I don't think I have to go back and fill in any more spots, so... That is what it's looking like.
All right, guys. That's the uh, the gist of the spoiler. Of course, we're going to go through. We'll sand this primer off and shoot it with some high build. Take care of all these pinholes. Then we'll color match it to the vehicle. But uh, yeah, so that's it. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. I do like it. I like it a lot. Oh yeah, and if you guys hadn't checked out the Misfit, make sure you check out the Misfit Chronicles. And there'll be more stuff coming on this real soon. Stay tuned. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.